It was a while ago now I bought a Rode SmartLav. This is a small lavalier type microphone. The special thing about this is that it's designed to feed into your mobile phone and use that as a portable recorder. So avoiding the need to be buying fancy wireless microphone setups and other audio recording devices. However, I found the quality from this road to be really poor. Low quality audio and a great deal of hiss in the background. And a look, a, a look around on the internet showed I wasn't the only person having these problems. Lots of others were also in similar situations. Rather sad, because I'd always seen Rode as one of the better quality manufacturers. And I'll leave a link around the place down below and things to my video I made of that earlier on this year. However, Rode recently brought out the SmartLav Plus an updated version of this lavalier microphone and I thought I would give that a try. And that's what I'm using now to make this recording. It's attached just down here and in turn is feeding into my Z10 mobile phone and without a doubt is giving vast improvements over the original Rode uh, SmartLav. One thing to realise with this, I did pay a little under £40 for it. That's around 75 American dollars. So don't expect the same quality from this wee thing as you would from, say, a £750 dollar device. This is down at the cheap and cheerful end of the market, but seems to be doing a competent job for the price. And now as a little experiment, I've just moved the microphone from being attached on the outside onto this wee jacket to actually being underneath my t-shirt. So it's totally hidden and doing this recording through various layers of clothing. Now, I've not tried this before, so when I listen back to this, this will be the first time I have tried doing that. And it'll be interesting to see how well this comes out. One thing to be aware of is that different phone manufacturers do use different audio encoders and uh, codecs and that sort of thing and in turn will have their systems set up to different bit rates and so on. So if you are making a video with say three or four different actors all using their own different mobile phones as recorders, do expect to have to do some work in post afterwards to get your different audio levels all up to the same uh, level and situation. And now just a very brief handheld test of the road outside. It's still stuck underneath various different layers of clothing so it's totally out of sight though I will say it does give the edge then of hopefully being out of any wind noise though I'll be curious to see how much clothes rustling it picks up at the same time or instead of the wind. Anyway this is all just trying to give an idea of the sound quality of this microphone in a couple of different situations, inside and both outside. And we'll have to see how this goes, because again, this is the first time I've actually tried it in this sort of situation. So I too will be curious to see what results we get. Anyway, there we go. A test of the Rode SmartLav Plus. Only had it a few days, but, well, we'll just have to see how it goes. Okay, right, enough. Goodbye.